All right, today we're gonna to be taking a look at everything I made with clay in 2022. We're just gonna go ahead and look at each creation one by one, starting with the first creation of the year, the Honey Hive Galaxy from Super Mario Galaxy. I still think the waterfall in this one is one of my favorite details that I've done on any creation, but I also just like all the layers and like the hilliness aspect of it. Anyway, our next creation is also from Super Mario Galaxy. It's Octoguy, still a great name, and still looks like he's perpetually stuck in the state of just eating a piece of really sour candy or something. Next up, we got Mount Beanpole from Super Mario 3D World. What I think is most interesting about this one is that unlike other 3D Mario games, this one feels like it's trying its hardest to emulate that like more blocky, artificial look of the 2D Mario games. And speaking of blocky, next up we got this Minecraft Coral Reef complete with seaweed and sea creatures and all kinds of sea stuff. Next up, we got Entity 17, the crawler from the back rooms. Because of the way I made the grainy texture on this one, it still sheds these like little white flakes. So because of that, I've been having to store it in a little Ziploc baggie. Next up, we got another back rooms creation, the dunk. Well, it's still kind of odd looking. It's one of the, I guess, cuter looking backrooms entities. Then we got the Bulborb larva from the Pikmin games. He's got so many things he could grow into. Not to mention that little pink spot on his butt. He is a champ. Then we got the Withering Blowhog, also from Pikmin, which I think has the best gradient that I've done on any creation. It's got a really nice, like, sunset look to it. Unfortunately, some of his whiskers came off, but he'll survive. And we got yet another Pikmin creation, the Water Dumple, whose lips are still looking crusty as ever. And lastly, we got the Blooper Racers from Mario Sunshine. I'm always fascinated by those more obscure enemies, especially the ones that are in Mario Sunshine. And there you have it, everything I made with clay in 2022. I'm looking forward to 2023, where we're gonna make more nifty little clay models. I also got some like commentary, like video essay type videos that I finished writing. So just expect a little more variety of content and we'll see how it goes. Hope you had a happy holidays. Hope you had a good new year. Feel free to like and comment and check out my other content. And I'll see y'all next time. Peace.